So Emma, very close to your second Diamond League victory, but a, a big personal best, so you must be delighted. Yeah, we had the USA Championships last weekend, and that's two races in 90 degree weather, and then a 12 hour flight here, so, um, and then some sightseeing in Paris. Sure. Um, so, given the circumstances, I'm really proud with that performance, um, especially kind of how I ran it, pushing the whole time. I think. I think I can run a lot faster if I'm in a race that I'm chasing people. Um, so the fact that I can lead two kilometers and then be right with the rabbit at the first kilometer, you know, so really be being the protagonist of the race, I think I'm proud of. Um, and I just hope I can run a little bit faster. Yeah. A second and a half faster is all I need. So I'm hoping to be in another fast race. Um, but if not, if the times don't come, just continue to be top three in the world. Well, I was going to say, for American fans, I know they'll know you very well, but from the European Diamond League face, your, your, your new face yeah. on the steeplechase, and you're slotting in feeling very comfortable towards the four of all the races. Yeah, I, I like running towards the front. I don't have great closing speed, as you probably saw today. So I'm comfortable being towards the front and pushing hard. So I hope the European Diamond League followers get to see more more of me up in the front, because um, that's how I prefer to run. I just wish I was in second or third, tucked in and having someone help me. But yeah, I um, hope to continue to be top three at finishes in the Diamond League and um, you know continue to chip away my time and maybe come away with another Diamond League win. Definitely. We'll look forward to speaking to you again. Thanks for Thank talking you. to us. Thank Thanks. you.